Okay, I made a video yesterday stating that the autofocus uh, for uh, sports action in the D500 is mind-boggling. It's incredible. Um, this uh, resort that I'm at is as big as a small town, and I was going to take some landscape shots. So the only thing I brought with me was a 20mm 1.8G, so I did a bunch of action shots using that lens, and some people just had a hissy fit. Uh, they just, there's always someone that wants to piss in your cornflakes. And uh, so uh, this are, these are a series of shots. Here you can see their feet are completely off the ground. Uh, a series of a continuous high bursts using the 24 to 70 2.8 Nikkor. So I've already used several lenses doing uh, continuous high bursts. And uh, while you can't tell it from the shot because of the way it's exposed, there's another nice one. Uh, this is actually uh, right at uh, 745 with uh, heavy overcast, so it was actually rather dark. Took these shots about an hour ago. Here you see feet are always uh, off, also off of the ground. So it doesn't matter what lens is used, so all the people that were having a pissy fit about continuous high burst shots, uh, the fact that I only brought one lens with me yesterday, for God's sakes, I wasn't planning on. Here you see feet are also off the ground. A good bit off the ground, by the way. And I know some people also will have a pissy fit about why these are so compositionally ugly, and there's a reason for that. Uh, the reason that this pole is blocking off the shot and I did not relocate myself was I wanted to check the continuous high autofocus of the camera that it would differentiate out the action, the person, from the pole. So these are compositionally ugly for a reason. I wanted to see if the camera would differentiate out the pole from the volleyball player. And uh, that was the case. So these shots in continuous high burst turned out lovely. I said all these shots were taken at f2.8 too, by the way. And most of them were taken at uh, 70 millimeters. Some were taken, uh, you know, near 60 millimeters. But uh, anyway, so for all the people yesterday that had a hissy fit, it's like, oh, that's not a true test. You can't say that the autofocus... Uh, Continuous autofocus auto on the D500 uh, is incredible because you're using a 20 millimeter. Well, my answer is, is shut up. It's good with any lens that's decent. And of course, 2470, 2.8 is far more than decent. But, you know, these are all burst shots, you know. There's nothing to deny here. I'll put uh, a couple of the shots up on the Flickr page so you can see that indeed they were taken with the 2470 Nikkor because they most certainly were, and all of them were taken at f2.8. So, yes, the D500 is that incredible. And uh, this is also overcast in low light, taken at uh, like a 745, too. So, once again, another really impressive uh, feature of the Nikon uh, D500. There's no denying it. You know, maybe uh, you think I have photoshopped her feet you know, levitating a three foot off the ground or something like that? Nope, I obviously didn't. So, proof once again, you know, haters gonna hate. There's always someone that's got something to complain about. But uh, proof's in the pudding, and here it is. The D500 is tits. It's awesome. Thanks for watching. Catch you later. Bye.